Hello everyone and welcome to our 888 update where I'm going to update you on the goings on of the $100,000 buy-in tournament. We are day three today. We started the day with 10 players. The first one to be knocked out was Chris Moore from Chicago, Illinois. Chris ran his kings into threes, which should be good, but Adrian Mateos spiked a three on the river, which completely decimated Chris Moore's stack. He then lost a few hands later, eliminated in 10th place. And it was fan favorite Fader Holtz, who had a lot of chips coming into day three, who was out in ninth place. He lost about half his chip stack and all six of his time chips to a big pot against Elio Fox. And it was two hands after that. He shoved his fives into Elio's sixes, and he was eliminated in ninth place. Adrian Mateos just busted right behind me. He lost a huge hand to Bryn Kenny. Bryn Kenny opened on the button. Adrian Mateos shoved his small blind. Bryn Kenny snap called with aces. Adrian Mateos had sevens. Aces held, and Mateos was off with two and a half big blinds. And he just shoved those blinds with Queen Jack. Elio Fox called with King 10. Elio hit a 10. Adrian Mateos couldn't better, and he was just eliminated. And out in seventh place is Jason Kuhn, who's had an historic run in the last three weeks. This almost $373,000 cash brings his three-week total to over $7 million in caches, and that's over three different tournaments. Wow. I know Jason was hoping to go farther in this tournament, but that's still pretty good. $7 million in three weeks? I'd take it. You guys, stay tuned to PokerNews.com, and of course, you can check out the final table tomorrow, the last six players on Twitch and Poker Go. Some of the biggest names in poker are still in this tournament. You got Nick Petrangelo, Steve Stevie Chidwick, Elio Fox, Andreas Eiler, Eamon Hada, and Bryn Kenny. Can't wait to see who the winner will be.